Hi, I'm Jack Teitelman, retired DEA agent, founder of the Titan Group, and the DEA expert behind the new and updated edition of the AHA Controlled Substance Logs. The AHA Controlled Substance Logs include a new section for logging unexpected events and incidents around your controlled substances, the Registrant Near Miss Incident Notification Log. This log allows for practitioners to document any irregularities as they pertain to controlled substances in the facility. A near miss is an unplanned event that has the potential to cause, but does not actually result in, an interruption to normal operations. Think of them as weird events that occur within a normal practice, such as a drop bottle or controlled substances that weren't properly logged in the rush of a medical emergency all of which are likely to happen in a busy and hectic hospital environment. The near-miss incident notification logs are to be used to record these events or any interactions with your controlled substances that do not have an explicit logical explanation. We log these events because creating and maintaining the most complete and accurate records possible is the DEA's core compliance requirement. Logging your near-miss events ensures that you are meeting that requirement and accounting for the whereabouts of all your controlled substances. The DEA expects your controlled substance logs to tell an accurate story about your drugs. Properly logging every irregularity gives you a level of security by having better control over your controlled substances and can protect you and your practice from fines and allegations of diversion by the DEA. And properly logging every irregularity can also help you and your staff recognize patterns in your controlled substance management. This enables you to step in before a few unusual events become a larger problem, such as diversion or a staff member mishandling drugs in the practice. Record the date, time, and staff member reporting the incident, along with a description of the issue or event that occurred and what was done in response. You should also record the date the DEA registrant was notified of the issue and explain how the issue was resolved. Lastly, the staff member who resolved the incident will initial and date the log to finish the report. Teach your staff what exactly a near-miss event is in the hospital environment and how to log these events properly. Training staff members who will be involved in using each log is imperative for a successful controlled substance protocol. It is crucial to get in the habit of logging irregular events as soon as they happen or are noticed in your practice. Time is of the essence. This will ensure that the event is logged accurately and that the event doesn't get missed. It is much easier to tackle the task when the event is fresh in your mind rather than revisiting it days later, or even worse, trying to think back on events when auditing records in the future. The AHA controlled substance logs have complete instructions for your team. Once implemented, the registrant near miss incident notification log will ensure that your practice is staying safe and DEA compliant.